Beautiful bumper as always. All right, I'm on camera today. <laughs> wow. Yay. All what right. is Haru wearing? <laughs> <laughs> yes. So um, in dancing, you can like customize people's costumes. But um, yes, we are here with Persona 5 dancing. Um, some people were wondering why we didn't just run Persona 5 for the marathon. Honestly, <laughs> I don't even think we'd get to the first fight if we did that. <laughs> But if we didn't finish the brain scratch playthrough, we're not finishing this one. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Very true. <laughs> okay, but there's a dancing game and it's fun. So we're going to play that. And um, I saw the bid war results last night and Hutaba won. And we're going to play as um, we're going to do all the Hutaba songs first. So each character has like two songs. So I'm going to do Hutaba first, then Haru, then Makoto, then Akachi, etc. And um, I'm not playing on all night mode. No, that's ridiculous. So <laughs> we're just going to do easy mode because normal mode is still ridiculously hard for me. Yeah, I, I'm just going to add like a very quick uh, shout out to Dark Blah, who last night put in $250 for Futaba. And then right as the stream shut off, put in another $50 saying, can I still put this for, for Futaba, lol? And because since it was so last minute, we said fine. And there we have so $300 right into Futaba, which made her number one. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Wait. I, I wasn't I wasn't gonna say this, but somebody in the chat said, Are you at Linkara's house? Because <laughs> the back yeah, it, oh, it's, oh it's my gosh. the same it's instead of comic books, it's games. It's games. <laughs> it looks like you're at Johnny's old house. Alright. So um each character gets a partner and I'm gonna prioritize the bid war tallies for partners, so Haru um is gone in second place, so it's gonna be Futaba and Haru for this song. Alright. Does she have a tail? Yes. Oh, no. Her dress. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> On with those sunglasses, what? <laughs> Catherine, you should see what I put a catchy in. <laughs> oh, I cannot wait. <laughs> I love this remix. I love this remix of Last Surprise. And Futaba oh, has turned tiny. Oh. <laughs> she dancing on the table. Yeah, in LeBlanc. Oh she's my trying God. to get people's attention because she's microscopic. <laughs> it's adorable. It's so cute. <laughs> Man, what, Utaba, what the fuck are you doing? Being adorable. <laughs> what did you do to my daughter, you brat? <laughs> <laughs> it's the after effects of the metaverse. <laughs> You said Futaba be safe. Get out of my house. Who boy. <laughs> scratch work. Like, what do you do when it says scratch? Oh, you uh, move the analog stick. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I forget if it's unlocked from the get-go or if it gets unlocked later, but you can also map it to the L and R buttons, which I find a lot easier. I oh, think yeah, that, that sounds like that's... an adjustment, so it might be unlocked later, but... Yeah, yeah, that seems like it'd be easier if you were using your thumbs already for the face buttons. I just remember it was a little bit awkward when I was doing uh, Persona 4 dancing on the Vita. Like, because <laughs> it, was, it wasn't on PlayStation 4 for a while. It was just on the Vita, and I was... I knew I had to flick the right analog stick in order to do the scratch motion, but I was, I was having so much trouble moving my thumb that far away from the buttons, and I was like, nah. Yeah. If only you could play that game touching the screen. There she is! Oh wow. my gosh! Those glasses! <laughs> oh, it's, oh, it's so cool that she's absolutely do the Watching someone do ballet in anime is really funny to me. <laughs> Pull her tail! Technically, we aren't doing P5D just because Joker got in. It's just because we wanted to do uh, P5D <laughs> over P3 or P4D. Plus, also, this game is, like, legit fun. I love the Persona dancing games. Right, I'm like... This is making crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. 
They're really good I'm rhythm never, games. On, I mean, I'm, I've never been into uh, like the like just rhythm, like especially like anime rhythm games in general. But I I went out of my way to get to check out this game because I love Persona Five so much, and I wanted some more more of the characters and some semblance. So I found out when I found out there was a story mode with like dialogue and interactions. I'm like, yep, I'm playing that. That's really yeah. cool. It's a really great game because, like, you can see everyone's um, social cutscenes and stuff. I just love seeing, like, the cast of characters interact with each other. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, yeah. You, you get to go to all their rooms. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you get to explore them in first person, and you can examine them like it's a Resident Evil game. It's amazing. Oh, what the heck? That's weird. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, like, you can go through their room and, like, go through their things. And, yeah. <laughs> when they're not present. They're not present. Okay, next song. <laughs> but it's okay, but it, it, it's all in a weird dreamscape, so it's fine. Don't worry about it. Alright, now look for the next. Um, also, <laughs> and also uh, Justine and Caroline are there for some reason. <laughs> it is funny, it's just funny, yeah, because you don't really get to see them interact with Justine and... Well, yeah, you never get to see them interact with Justine and Caroline in the in P5, so just getting to see... Uh, yeah, so just getting to see them talk with them and like bounce off them is really funny. Oh, yeah. like, yeah, the rest of the cast, you mean. Oh, that's yeah. interesting, yeah. Yeah, because, well, all right, I'm just going to say this. Well, we're, 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 we'll we'll go full in on vanilla P5 spoiler uh, talk in this, but uh, we'll, uh, we'll be silent on uh, Persona 5 Royal, because I know, yeah. like, yeah, Catherine hasn't fair. played Royal, and it's still recent. I know a lot of other people haven't fully gone through it, so we're, we'll, we'll mention, uh, like, mention some things about Royal, but we're not going to go full spoilers. I'm okay, sorry, Morgana, good. that was... <laughs> that was something else. <laughs> the headphones and the oversized crown. Hey, Catherine, I did love you this. know that Morgana turns into a boss? What a spoiler. Oh, no. Oh. I know he turns into a cute boy. <laughs> oh, I guess that's right. <laughs> Oops. I haven't even played the games. <laughs> Aren't you thinking of Teddy? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I don't know how Teddy spawned a human body, but he did somehow by doing sit-ups. <laughs> no, I, 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 I thought by doing sit-ups. <laughs> I, I, I thought I thought the game story takes place after the events of Persona Five. I'm pretty sure it does because they they see just because they recognize Justine and Caroline, and they're like, oh, why why are you why are you separated again? And they're like, oh. I yeah, think, they they just. I feel like it. with all the with all the spinoffs like PQ and PQ2, it's like it's a very specific day when these spinoffs happen. Yeah. Because yeah, I, I know, I know I've yeah. seen someone on our Mega 10 made a giant like SMT multiverse timeline thing. First of all, it was clearly like kind of a joke because they put like <laughs> They put like what? What did they put like? Oh yeah, they put like um, Devil May Cry. There. Oh my god! <laughs> like the entirety of the Fire Emblem series because of Tokyo Mirage Sessions, but they did like put. Um, I, I remember they put like PQ, and it was like okay, on this day in this year, PQ three cast goes and PQ four cast goes. And then I think for the dancing names, they were like, I have no idea. <laughs> I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Q2 yeah, takes place like within that like time period where like ever. Yeah, it's like that that in between during Okumura's Palace. That's pretty much the only part it could take place. But then you have like yeah, in the party, and like um, I, it's obvious for for P3 cast, it has to be. And I know I, I know it's specific day. I don't remember the day, but it has to be in September because that's the only time Shinji's in the party. Yeah, and then uh, what? Yeah, and then yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, the dancing game. I, I'm pretty sure it takes place after the events because yeah, the the way the way the party is and the way the way they even talk about. The, I think they mention like, oh yeah, the events of the game had already happened. So oh my god, yeah. oh uh, my god, huh? What? It's here to bust a move. <laughs> yep, it's Kika. Keep doing. Oh, his faces. You can just work on it up like Sonic too. <laughs> Making the silliest faces. You can dress Morgana as Sonic. Mm -hmm. Really? <laughs> yeah. Is is the Burroughs costume in this game or is that in main P5? Because I know he has the, a Burroughs costume. The what costume? 
um, Burroughs, which is a SMT4 thing. It's like a lady in a white dress. Morgana has oh. a Burroughs costume. It's really weird looking. I feel like they should have given it to Futaba. Um, I know. No, I know. Is it in this game where Joker can dress up as Demi Fiend? As what? Demi Fiend from SMT3. I think that's just the main game. Oh, okay. Okay, so I've cleared all of um, Futaba songs, and so next we're gonna go do Haru. I'm so glad that like legit people donated for her because she needs more love. Yeah, Haru, 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 Haru always kind of has that. I don't know what the name is, but it, it's it's that it's that quote unquote last character syndrome, where like the character that comes in like last, like last, so they they don't get as much screen time or attention as a lot of other like the the other main characters. Oh, no, don't put that mask on her. Oh, put that mask no. on? Okay. No. no. <laughs> oh, I hate it. I hate yes. it. Hutaba again. And then who's the auto character? Okay, Mak oh, that's perfect. That's like the top three. Awesome. You fool. <laughs> why did you do that? Because cause why not? <laughs> you, you, don't, you, don't, you don't like Tanaka? <laughs> He's broadcasting over the airwaves to you? Look, when everyone voted Haru, we knew that they meant Tanaka. Yes. <laughs> Tanaka is the best girl. For me. <laughs> that mess first. <laughs> Har Haru X screen time OTP. I love how much detail went into all these dance routines. Yeah, it's really cool. This is pretty good. The thing I like is that there's actually a choreography mode. So like if you want it to be taken away from just like the main song part of it, you can just have like the isolated model doing the choreography and you can kind of dance along with them. Oh, that's super cool. Is this because a catch you didn't get first when you came save hard with the awful mess? <laughs> Oh my god. Oh that's oh that's so cute, like Futaba's trying to <laughs> ballet. She's like, yay! They even tell her that like you're doing your best. <laughs> oh. It's so wholesome. Mm -hmm. cool, Do we have any Imagine donations? this game in VR. Yes. Not bad. Do you not comprehend this passion? That can let you be found. I'm never gonna throw the key. So elegant. How could she see in that thing? <laughs> she just does. It's a video game, no question. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we, we have a couple new donations. Do you oh, want me yeah, to wait yeah. until the, between the song, Kara? Yeah, you can do it between the song. Between the song? Okay. Just picture Makoto being like, Haru, what are you wearing? I, th I thought we were wearing norm like our masks, like our normal masks. <laughs> Why and I said mask, winter... so that's an interesting choice. <laughs> she's, wearing, she's wearing her winter uniform and her mask. It doesn't fit. I think Akechi, when he's just in his suit and he has his mask on, he looks sinister as hell. It's awesome. What? Which mask? His, his, his no, first Elliot, mask? No, we are not playing mask? this with a Miku controller. Just his lawn red crow mask. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> The one that Yukiko and PQ2 uh, is like, it looks like you would poke someone in the back with that mask. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, wow, that's subtle. <laughs> so Elliot's off screen and he said that I should play this with the Hatsune and Miku controller. That we have. <laughs> <laughs> the one that he used for his um Sonic Adventure playthrough. <laughs> oh, her, her stage costume is so cute. Oh, I that's know. really cute. Song. Um, right. So we have a couple donations. I saw someone asking what our total is. Our total is twenty thousand uh, dollars, which is amazing. 
Um, we have five dollar donation from Sarah B. Hot take: Well, Futaba is best P five girl. Joker X Makoto is best P five couple. Who do you think is the best P five girl slash P five couple? Put this towards the Pikmin plush, red or blue, because I'm a filthy plushy degenerate. Ooh, uh, there, very quickly, yeah, very quickly, just want to say because we haven't mentioned it yet. Yeah, the daily raffle for today is yeah. a Pikmin plush. But not just you can pick between uh, the, any of the colors of Pikmin. So if you win that, you can let us know if you want red, blue, or yellow, and then we'll get you that one. Um, and we'll, and, we'll get yeah, to and that. I want to read the other donation. Um, yeah, go read the first. Yeah. Okay. We have a five dollar donation from Dark Flaw again. <laughs> sorry to all the Haru fans out there, but I couldn't leave Best Girl at only five bucks. Lol. Thank you so much for your donations last night. No, are you putting Ryuji in that mask too? No. Ryuji <laughs> okay. doesn't deserve to be in the mask. Oh, it's for the e e Igor mask. Oh my gosh, are those Igor glasses? That's hilarious. I might have gone over them, but where? Yes, I'll put them in that. <laughs> oh no, those are hilarious. Pink headphones, and we good. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. As as for that as for that question, uh, gir, um, okay, this is really hard because I think my, my my favorite character of all the girls is Futaba. I think like well, Futaba and Ryuji are my two favorite characters in the game. Mm -hmm. So I think that, that that's only but in terms of couple, I'd actually go with Joker Kasumi. Oh, I think okay. after playing Royal, I think because Royal very much like pushes the two of them together and i really like how that because i think it's like since a lot of with a lot of their, their couples they're kind of you they're they're kind of a sense of like like with with uh yeah with yeah uh, with on with on makoto futaba and haru they kind of all have kind of equal uh, percentage of oh they he joker can work with all of them but then when royal he, they're very much kind of pushed like kim and kasumi together and i think that were I, I really like how like their kind of relationship and interaction between each other so like they're they're my favorite couple nice okay. i was playing royal um a couple weeks ago and i love kasumi so she's become one of my favorite characters, along with Makoto. I've always loved Makoto. And um, she's great. Favorite couple? <laughs> my answer's trash. My answer's so trash. Uh -oh. Okay, Sarah. We're in the dumpster together. We're in the dumpster. For meme purposes, I say, um, run and I get Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> but see... But see, the better no, the better we'll couple about this is Monday, the... so I don't need to go into any more detail about that. Nope. Lord the, Chatroom, the... I just gotta I just gotta interject to explain to Lord Chatroom <laughs> that the Discord that we're using for this charity event has a war going on between a catchy fans and a catchy haters. Yes. Now, well, for, well, first, I, I gotta say for well first, Akira and Ryuji is by far the best couple. Like right, right off that they are they're by far good. a they're much better yeah, couple. Yeah. Like they, 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 they have they have such like Ryuji is such the best bro and just the, he is always so loving and caring. And with for, for Akira and it's like yeah, they, those two are the perfect couple. Not 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 the extremely unhealthy relationship that is Akira <laughs> and Akechi. Shuake, let's go. It's 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 toxic, dude. It, all all of these rival all of these rival ship relationships are very toxic, and nobody wants to say it, but I'm gonna say it. <laughs> it's it, it's it's the same. Pe it's like the same people who ship Bakugo and Midori together. It's just no. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Where do you stand in the civil war? Uh, I don't see it personally, but you know, I'm if I'm whatever. If you want to ship them, go ahead. Yeah, I'm, 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 here, I'm, I'm gonna say. Way, here, I'm, is this your I'm way of put... saying I hate a catchy, but I don't want to make Caro mad? <laughs> <laughs> I like a catchy as a character. I just don't see the relationship. <laughs> Whatever. Here, 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 I, I want to make my point clear. I like a catchy as a character and as an antagonist and yes. as a piece of shit who is very fun to watch, yes. especially in Royal yes. when you can just That's go full batshit. That's what I mean. But as 
as an ooh good boy that Joker and Akechi need to kiss each other in order to make everything better. No, he, 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 he's such he's such a boring flat like that, 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 that. It's such a boring flat note that just kind of is like, oh, get away with everything interesting about Akechi just because you don't want to make you know you want to take all the interesting complex parts about Akechi just because you want the two of them to fuck that. That's it. That's what I'm mad about. I don't like. I I don't hate a catchy. I hate a catchy stands. That's my stance. That's Damn. my thing. Wow, wow, what a catchy go burr. Fun lighting the bridge on fire. Burn. <laughs> Yeah, see, someone in the chat, Uwu, good boy, Akechi, would dis Akechi himself would despise Uwu, good boy, Akechi. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna get my Kodo knocked out. Okay. Burn my bread, wrong game. <laughs> okay. Free dancing. Um, so Bring what out the dollar the amounts between On and Yusuke? Ooh. Were they tied, or? Uh, Yusuke uh, no, was head on. Yeah, Yusuke was head on. Okay, I'll choose Yusuke. Oh good, I want to see him dance. Oh, oh you're doing Whims of Fate next? Yeah. Oh my gosh, those, those cat earphones. And to answer the question from ages ago, uh, Makoto is my best girl, lover. She's great. Mm -hmm. And in terms of ship, I think Ryuji and An are adorable that's together. That's a good one. Oh, yeah, it's a good them. one. Oh. Okay. I completely forgot about this, but I know there's a scene uh, when I was playing Royal. I forgot about that. There's a scene where like An and Makoto kind of have like their their heart to heart after like they like after like they, they come together in a group. There's like a scene where, like they have a heart to heart where they kind of like get over their baggage, and then they're like, oh, how, how about how about we go 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 and get some crepes together? And then like you can go and like see them like going to buy crepes. It's like, oh, they're on a date. That's adorable. Yeah, Elliot said if he couldn't hear him, um, how do you feel about shipping Joker and Futaba? Uh, uh. <laughs> nah, nah. Same. Same. See? Same. Nah. I feel the same. I feel like Joker and Futaba share like a brother sister relationship, and I wouldn't ship them. Yeah, personally, the, I don't think it's a, I, I don't yeah, I don't put it like I, I put it at the bottom among like the other main characters, but I don't think it's as disgusting as a lot of people say. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't, I don't think their relationship is so uh, grounded into that brother sister mold that it's like that it'd be gross. I think it's just like, oh, I think he I think he's a better fit for other characters, but I wouldn't say that, oh, you could never ship him with uh, her. Especially because, I mean, like, K K K K K Kasumi is, like, the same age, so it's, like, it's not even, like, a, an, a, an age issue. Valid point. Keep going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for, like, and I, I don't have context for a lot of these relationships because I haven't played the game yet, but, like, my, I don't, I get very turned off by, like, shipping characters with siblings, either, you know, emotional siblings or, like, biological siblings, and that was my understanding of Joker and Futaba's relationship was yeah. very much like sibling like relationship, even if they aren't blood siblings. Um, yeah, I took the relationship as kind of like a caregiver, a big brother kind of situation. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, she's been closed off from society, closed off from the whole world for so long, and she's not used to anything, and she's socially awkward. And Joker's kind of bringing her into the real world, kind of trying to help her adjust to society and i just i find it a little bit weird for him to take advantage of that situation and, and engage mm -hmm. in a relationship with her at that point like maybe when they grow up a little sure yeah. but not not during the events of p5 mm -hmm. yeah I, I think that that's a relationship where it's like if she was the one who went for it like rather than uh he uh like going for like it's like the whole thing of like oh if she came to him to want to do a relationship first i think that's fine over like he starting it And then you get the and then you get the weird thing of like some of the adults when it's just kind of like a eh. yeah. <laughs> I mean, I mean, like, I mean, like, like, like Kawakami's great. It's just, just, just Kawakami's great as long as you don't try to go with her because yeah. then it's weird. If the genders were reversed, if the genders were reversed. <laughs> okay, ah. does anyone want to ship Kam? Kawakami with Kamashita. That's what Elliot said. Why? Oh God, Why would you What the say fuck that? is wrong with you? I'd like to ship Kamashita with a grave. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Okay, um, now that I finished the song, um, I can show chat. Oh, I got King Crazy, sweet. Um, my Makoto plushie. I got her a couple years ago. She's really cute. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, that's so cute. She's so flat. I know, but she's, she's cutie. She just sits with me. All right. I, I really, I really love Mak Makoto's dancing outfit. I think is my favorite. Uh, that's of a really all cute outfit. outfit. Mm -hmm. All these dancing outfits are so cute. The ones at P3 are adorable too. I remember I, I made like a list. I was like going through and seeing like what like a I think I think it was going through like a ranking of uh the all the all of the characters you can go in a relationship in order of who likes you the most. And it was like I think it was uh uh Haru was yeah I think Haru is like the only one of them who like actively like show like that that like actively like shows that she's like that, that that she's interested and she likes you, which is why it always pains me whenever you have to turn her down and she's genuinely upset about it. Oh, yeah. Like uh, Haru, uh, then there's uh, 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 Ch Chihaya, the fortune teller. Like yeah. she, uh, she, she, like she, like because she asks you, like, oh, are you, are, are you interested in older? I think she's like, oh, you're, are you interested in older women and stuff like that? Yeah. And then like if you end up turning her down, because she, she says, oh, are you interested in me? Like she's very clearly interested in you. But if you turn her down, she's like, oh, okay, I guess I misunderstood. So it's like oh. she, she oh. clearly, she clearly likes you. She, yeah, she likes Joker, but uh, she isn't like completely upset if you turn her yeah, down. She handles it like an adult. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. there's like, yeah, then there's like Makoto and uh, Makoto and On, which are like a case of like, oh, if you there, there's like there's that there's a twinkle of it where if you if you re reciprocate their feelings, then they'll be like, oh yeah, I do like you. But if you don't say anything, then they're like, oh, they just don't realize it. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. And then there's. Oh, go on. Yeah. Oh no, go ahead. Yeah, that was it. I was just saying, I had such an awkward moment when I first played Persona 4 because uh, you can take extracurricular class activities and you're allowed to choose between like music and drama. And in real life, I was in drama club in high school. So I'm like, of course, I'm taking drama. And then you get paired up with this girl, Yumi. Yeah. And at the, at the tail end of that quest, at the tail end of that social link, um, she basically outright admits her feelings to you and says like, if you, if you want to be my boyfriend, just come hug me or come closer. And if you don't, I understand. <laughs> and I'm like, well, I'm with Chie. I can't. <laughs> so so I, I just left the classroom and left her hanging. <laughs> oh, like, God, oh, yeah. There was no alternative. <laughs> you feel like such a dick afterwards. Yeah, yeah and, and, and not, 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 to, not, to, not to put any spoilers, but yeah, yeah Kasumi's somebody else who shows uh, interest. Uh, in Joker as well, that helps. Mm -hmm. There, uh, there is a fun. I'm, I'm remembering of a funny uh, uh, moment uh, where it, it was it was during Yusuke's uh, social link, where they they're, they're going off like they go off. Uh, him and him and Joker are going off like on a boat, like to do some painting, and they're like painting like a, a man and a woman on a boat. And he's like, "Oh, I'm painting like the concept of love." So this is a couple. Then they end up like noticing the couple, and they find out, "Oh no, they're, they're brother and sister." Oh yeah. no. <laughs> And because, right. because though they, they think that because that whole area is for couples, so then they're like, "Whoops!" And then the, the the brother and sister complain. It's like, "I told you we shouldn't have done this." And then they're like, "Wait a minute! If this place is for couples, then what are you two doing here?" And then Joker and Yusuke are like, "Ah, uh, let's get out of here." Why can't we date the boys? <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I think I heard people are trying to add back in. Um, in P4 Golden, because of the the Steam release, people are trying to mod back in the yeah. aborted Yusuke uh, romance social link because the dialogue, the English dialogue, was still in the game files even on the PS2 version. Hmm. So they're modding that back in. Oh, hey. hey. I will make it canon. Let female main character date the girls. Yes. Give us more female main character then. Yeah, I, I would. I don't even want like an option. Like, just make the next one a female character, mm. and then okay. let's do an entire Persona game around that. Mm -hmm. So, we've gone through all the Makoto songs. It's a catchy time. Yeah. yeah! <laughs> Catherine, look, uh, what I, look, look what I put him in. Isn't it cute? I love it. It's so Why cute. Why is he a cat? <laughs> Why so, not? to make this even more fucked up, Futaba is his partner. Don't oh, do that! That's she terrible! She won the big part! She got first! They voted. 
<laughs> they uh, voted. The people voted. We gotta listen to the people. Uh, yes, the, the, per the person <laughs> responsible for all of her trauma. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really see a multiple partners. I've only seen people show this off with Joker as the partner. Utaba would have been picked anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. You should listen to his dialogue during it. It's great. I can't hear it. <laughs> I will say this: R R Robbie Damon, he 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 is perfect. She is perfectione <laughs> as him. He is so good. I like the little faces he occasionally makes where you're like, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> so like throughout the song, he'll just keep saying, my power's growing. Yes, yes, while he's dancing. Okay. Yeah. Are you proud of me, daddy? <laughs> no, but um, I have the collector's edition of p5p3 and that came with um persona 4 dancing but to oh, my knowledge you can only get persona 4 dancing on ps4 if you get the collection i'm not sure oh. if you can buy it separately oh that's annoying it, 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 i thought you could get it digitally yeah digitally is probably what it is yeah that, that, that's weird. they never yeah they never released p4 dancing on ps4 like physically yeah you just have to get it digitally okay. <laughs> carol you're lucky that willpower is a dope song <laughs> it is a dope song. You know who else is dope? Akechi. Yeah. <laughs> and someone, someone put, someone put, uh, uh, someone put, uh, 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 Dachi, uh, a bunch of greater thens Akechi. What? Uh, serious? Adachi's such an ass. Adachi, I'm gonna kill two people because they turned me down. Yeah. Gee, I wonder who else killed multiple people for no reason. <laughs> for no reason. Mm. Look, they're cute together. Look. Oh my gosh! This is how oh, you solve your issues. You dance. There, there are people. Who, there are people who actually ship him with, uh, with Futaba and Haru, and just, just. Unfortunately, uh, yes, I actually do not accept that ship. I have no interest in that ship. <laughs> yeah, P five would be really interesting from a female perspective, considering all of the sociological issues. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know why people said Cats was a bad movie. This is great. <laughs> he does kind of look like the... He looks like a skinny version of the James Corden cat. Oh my god, <laughs> stop. And then that, 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 that weird tux. I love that face at the end. I know. His power is grown. Bless it, Catchy. Bless. Yes. Alright. Alright, high score... All right, calm down, chat room. He only has one song. Don't, don't worry, we're not going to play him anymore. He only has one DLC song. Okay, and then next was... Let me check my phone, because I've written it down. Um, It's already 10.34. Wow. Okay, Ryuji's next, so we're going to play through Ryuji songs. Ryuji. Jeez. Okay, we'll do... Yeah. Got an hour and a half left for this. We good, we good. We good. I, 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 get, I get people keep saying the pancakes as the meme, but it's like he doesn't actually like pancakes like that much. It's it's just a meme. Yeah. Is he sunglasses and glasses? Yeah, I'm making him wear two sunglasses at the same time. Perfect. And you know how memes are. They just... They just become a thing somehow. It's like when Skyrim came out and everyone was talking about arrows in the knees, and I was just like, yeah. "Oh, that was a thing." Okay. <laughs> there, there, there is a there is a pretty funny callback in uh, Royal with one. There, 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 there's one. There, there's like a line of dialogue that references that. That's pretty funny. Show your skills. <laughs> but dude, why are you doing the nay nay? <laughs> I mean, Ryuji would definitely do the nay nay. Ryuji be the one to Fortnite dance. Yes. Ryuji. The kanji pasta. <laughs> <That's so laughs> Let me slouch real bad. Oh my gosh, what is this dance? <laughs> <laughs> He's in track and field. <laughs> yeah. He was. Was in track and field. Let's do this. Oh. 
Oh my god, Elliot. <laughs> He's asking if this is the part- is- is this the spot- the spot where, um, Shiho- No! Uh, yeah! Yeah, Elliot! <laughs> See? Look what you did! Oh my, oh my god! god! It was right after. Right after. Right after! <laughs> <laughs> wow! Wow! For real? For real? <laughs> I'm gonna go to hell when I die. <laughs> Elliot, seriously. <laughs> she ho deserved more yeah, attention. She, she should have been in more. I always thought she should have been a social link that uh, unlocked after you finished on story. Yeah. Um, look at these boys dancing. Mm. Hey. hey. I like how they're not on the same wavelength like, with dancing at all. Oh, okay, <laughs> fine, we'll try. Which is basically completely in character for them. Yeah. I love, I love how everyone dances based on their character and personality. Yeah, like, I, 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 I love these guys so much. Like, I'll just take any new, like, any, like, anything little or small just w with them. Like, like, it's gotten to the point where I really want to go through, I want to go through and make a compilation, a compilation of all of the original moments from, uh, from the Persona 5 anime. Because, like, a lot, a lot of it isn't, uh, all of the, like, stuff that is basically just a re, like, repurposing the stuff from the games aren't that interesting. But anytime they do something different, it's really fun. Yeah. And, like, interesting. Yeah. Like, Oh. Those are my favorite parts of the Persona 4 anime. Oh, right. And they would do like new things that weren't in the games for sure. Yeah. Yeah. People always post the post online that the scene when they go when they go inside the the, the the makeshift haunted house and the Joker tries to take the mask off them and Reggie has to slap him and be like, stop that. Oh, <laughs> well, even if people hate the hate that um, anime, it's gonna so, be having a dub soon. So, so Elliot, um the reason why um the Persona 4 anime, I think, is better than the 5 one because, like, I don't know. I just, I feel like the quality in 4 is better. And I like the character isn't interactions it, in 4 better than 5. Isn't it also animated, like, these actually good? Well, yeah, yeah, there's actually that. <laughs> it's animated much better. Well, yeah, was it, like, isn't, isn't it a, 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 a1, a1 did the person the, did the P4 anime? Yeah, it was, um... It, it, it was sort out online dudes oh so studio i won yeah they do yeah they do pretty and, consistently good stuff yeah and, and also kakia <laughs> and a bunch of other stuff oh, yeah. what trophy did you get um keeper starlight or something i forgot i splashed across the screen <laughs> <laughs> and also some um, yeah someone mentioned oh, go ahead yeah um elliot was also wondering why a lot of people don't like the p5 anime or at least aren't really keen on it Indifferent, yeah. Um, for me, it was like it's supposed to be animation quality, and it, and like to me, it seemed like a lot of things were like rehashing the original. It had an awkward pacing too, because there's so much that happens in P five. Mm. Was it was it a twenty like twenty four episode or thirteen episodes? Twenty four episodes. Okay, at least it had that. But I mean, it sounds like just based on, I mean, it, that doesn't mean twenty four episodes was enough. But. Actually, wait. Let me let me double check. Cause I'm pretty sure it wasn't exactly that. Because I know. Okay. They, I feel like it was uh, a little more. I feel like there were some also also like some other TV specials. Oh yeah, no. I was. It, it was 26 episodes, okay. which got which it was 26 episodes, but that got all the way to spoiler uh, a catchy kill quote unquote killing Ren. That was 26, and then they had a 27 and a 28 a, a special episode, which covered the rest of the game. What? That, they, okay, even from what I know, not having playing the game, playing the game, that two episodes. Yeah, for, because there's still a that, lot that, that sounds ridiculous. That's not, like they. Sh I I'm guessing it was a funding thing, but. It sounds like it should have been a two season. And yeah, two yeah. Season there, there was one. Yeah, there's one episode that covered all of the Shido stuff, and then one episode that covered all of the um, memento. Uh, no, not uh, the uh, the Yelda bot stuff. 
and then they had and then they had two OVAs that they released afterwards. One of them, which is just kind of like uh, one of them is which is like uh, uh, Akira reflecting on like uh, Akechi, and then the other one, which is kind of like a, a, a quote unquote no, a sort of non canon like Valentine's Day episode where it's like uh, Joker going through all these different scenarios of going out on dates with all the girls right. and Ryuji. <laughs> and Ryuji, yes. Yes. Oh, see, I, I said Akira, even though in the anime it's Ren. I, I just, I just keep going back and forth between. Cause also, because the, the, the Persona Five manga has been coming out in English, and they call him Akira in that, so oh, okay. that's also right. the why. And I like Akira. Akira, I think, is a better name than Ren. Um, at first people were calling him Akira, but then everyone just started calling him Ren. I admit I use both. Yeah, I feel like I see more people calling him Akira. Yeah. But. And people, uh, and people mentioned in the thing about uh, Persona Five Scramble, which hopefully, since they 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 they, they said that they are working on localization, so it should be coming out early next year. I hope so, cause I'm super interested in that game. I want a it's a it's a full Persona Five sequel. That's I like know. also kind of a weird uh like. Warriors esque game, yes, please. Yeah, I was telling y'all on Monday, I've never played a Musou game, and I was gonna make Persona 5 Scramble my first one. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm just reminded of when, of when it was announced that his like anime name is going to be Ren, and then people made fan art of Joker as Ren, like Ren and Stimpy. <laughs> <laughs> Eat, eat more Ghana. <laughs> what the what? Elliot, stop! Um, I don't know if you heard that, but Elliot said, "I'll review your true form, but in Ren's voice, like Ren and Stimpy Ren." <laughs> that was me who said that. I will kill you. <laughs> Ryan, you say that even though technically a catchy would definitely be Ren in personality-wise. <laughs> And yeah, Joker would definitely be Stimpy in that, uh... Joker's definitely fucking Stimpy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take a drink of water. Who just joined? It's Run! What do you mean we're going to steal the treasure? We don't have all day to do this, you simple. <laughs> <laughs> Akira, I'm so happy! Walked over to You! You disgust me. <laughs> oh my god. Y'all are y'all y'all are too much. I loved Renin's to be growing up, so this is great. <laughs> Yusuke, your adoptive father's a piece of shit! Stop painting for him, God! Okay. So I think we've, I think I played through all of the um Ryuji songs. So now we're gonna do Yusuke. Yeah. Oh, and you have to let them paint you in the nude! <laughs> Powdered Toast Kamoshida Man. Yes. No! Oh god. Oh, I, god. I, lo I love that in Q2, Kamoshida Man. Oh my gosh. Kamoshida Man! <laughs> okay. What would, what would Shido's dance be like? Man, I, I forgot fighting that boss again that he basically just turns into Senator Armstrong. I'm like, oh, oh yeah. <laughs> well, of course. <laughs> Where did you get? How did you get the nano machines into the fandom verse? Um, the, the song that we're about to dance to next is one of my personal favorites. Or we just go to um, Sojiro and uh, Ren doing Happy Happy Joy, just like. Ren! Oh, Ren! <laughs> he just goes upstairs and then Ren just sits up in the bed from upstairs. <laughs> what? It's it's my favorite song. Happy, happy, joy, click. Joy, joy. joy. <laughs> Who boy? And a happy, happy, joy, joy is the guy singing it instead of the crazy old, like, prospector guy. It's, um, uh, Igor. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I told you I shoot, but you yeah. didn't What's believe me. Why did didn't you, you believe me? Are you talking about of nature? They don't know that they're ugly. Are, are you talking about evil Igor or good Igor? 
Just regular Igor from the Velvet Room and all that. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Or, or you can do Shadow. Or you can do Shadow Igor. Well, I'm more doing his. I'm, I was gonna say I'm more doing his voice from P5. Yeah, yeah I, I like I like his P5 voice that uh, that uh, yeah, the Shadow's voice actor does it. I'm blanking on the name. Uh, God, why why do I keep, I keep blanking on that dude's Current name? Shadow's voice. Yeah, the guy who plays Shadow. Oh, and, yeah, Kirk Thorne. Yeah, he Thorne. plays uh, he plays Yaldabaoth, and I really I really like that deep like baritone voice that he does for Igor. Welcome to my velvet room. <laughs> oh, yeah, Igor's the... actor change between four and uh, five. Uh, the actor in Japan died, so they uh. had to change the voice in Japan. So that's they are kind of trying to explain that in the universe by changing the voice actor everywhere. Yeah, they, they, well, they, they made it into a twist because, like, they had they had the voice changed, but they made it so, like, oh, it's, well, it's, the voice te it's technically a different character. Yeah, but then it, but yeah, but yeah, you, 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 you know what happens at the reveal that oh, that that Igor was actually just yelled about the whole time, and then the real Igor comes back and he has a voice similar to uh, like the classic original. Igor. Yeah, huh? That's it's, it's it's a meta idea. Well, yeah, it, that is really smart because, like, again, like I, even though like I didn't know about like I didn't really like because I had no experience with the other Persona games, I did know about that changed voice actor. So I'm like, oh, he just sounds like this. And then when the plot twist came out, I was like, what? They, they did the Metal Gear Solid Five plot twist better than the Metal Gear Solid Five. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was hoping so bad at the end of Five that David Hayter was going to be the, the the original big boss. Yeah, that would have made so much more sense. It's like that would have explained the voice actor change, but nope, they just didn't. Oh yeah, see, so yeah, the real Igor in Japan reuses P3 and 4 voice clips. Yeah, so it's going to be really awkward when they get whenever they do Persona 6 and they have to figure out what to actually do with Igor. Yeah, yeah, Persona 6. <laughs> one, uh, I mean, I mean they're going to make times. they're going to make one at some point. They're going to make one at some point. I, I know it's just so. Persona crazy 5 did way like... too well not to. We haven't had our fighting game yet. I know. Persona 5 so 3, Athena. baby! I mean, Joker's in Smash. What more do you need? <laughs> Persona 5 3, baby! Ryan? Just wants money. <laughs> yes. We want a fighting game. It is a fighting game. No. <laughs> yes, it is. How, how, long, how long was it in between P4 and P4 of Arena? Was it like it five about, years? It was about four or five years, yeah. Yeah, I assume it's probably going to be a bit long, especially because Scramble will will have just come out. I just assume it's probably going to be much longer until an, are an arena comes out. Well, it also depends on what Arxis is doing. Yeah. Because they're kind of too busy making Guilty Gear to work on something else at the moment. Also, they got to give me SMT5, baby! Yes, SMT5! Let's go! P5. I, can't P5. Wait for I can't wait for everyone to pick that up after playing Persona 5. It's like, oh, it's basically the same thing, and then they run into the brick wall that is Shin Megami Tensei's difficulty. Yeah. I'm curious what the boss will be in this game. Uh, the, like, the boss, like Minotaur, uh, Matador. But that's going to be... Oh, I'm so hyped. Everyone on Reddit Megaton is so thirsty for 5-kun. It's great. <laughs> Someone put a, a P5 Extreme Beach Volleyball or something. <laughs> yeah! Oh my god. <laughs> but, it's yeah, nothing but, the, but it's nothing but the personas of themselves, none of the human characters. <laughs> Remember when, like, the news broke a few years ago that, like, P5R was, like, getting trademarked or something, and people thought it was the Persona 5 racing game? <laughs> <laughs> it's great. I mean, I wouldn't mind a Persona Kart Racer. I want to drive as Mara. Just have, like, you know, all the characters from 3, 4, and 5 in there. And, yeah, and somebody, uh, yeah, somebody mentioned also in the chat that the people have been going through, like, the, the P5R code, and they've been finding a lot of deleted stuff, like, deleted, like, uh, areas and plot stuff. It's been really interesting. Like, one one of the original, like, it, it seemed like uh, they were going to have, like, flashbacks to each of the palace members. Uh, like well, while you're in the palace, like show like scenes of them, like that, that would flesh out the characters, and that would have been really interesting. I wish they would have kept that in. It's weird that they took it out. I mean, <laughs> we're gonna dancing so cute. Oh my god! Oh, he's wearing Teddy's outfit. Yep, I put Morgana in Teddy's oh. outfit. Oh. So 
that's Teddy's outfit. Oh, that was so cute. I just thought it was like a Santa outfit. No, there is a Santa outfit though, I believe. Cute. And this... <gasps> there were going to be conversations about the goofy costumes in P5R. Aww. Oh yeah, that's remember I did I did see that. Yeah, they had like every character had like a, a response to like the characters wearing the com like yeah wearing the outfits. That's disappointing that they took it out because those are funny from what I've seen of P4 where it's like. <laughs> Yosuke gets so mad at some of the things you can dress him in. Now, yeah, Naruto, I did. Oh. Naruto gets all, like, flummished when, like, uh, you put on just a towel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, are you, are you going to put on any extra clothes? No, you're just going to wear that towel? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know about that, that um, Mish Mishima and Afumi were both uh, supposed to be Phantom Thieves in the original version of P5, but then that was cut because they had, like, too many people already. Huh? You don't want too big of a party in these types of games. Yeah. Yeah, that's one thing I think Persona 6 could benefit from, just, like, shorten the party a little bit. Mm. Well, I posted in the chat earlier, but what if you kind of... Pe people, while people like uh, social links, it's also takes up a ton of time. What if instead six was your main character was whoever was the focus of the arc and you played as them and kind of just did you know play the game through their eyes and just kind of minimize the social link stuff and have just their stories be the social links with like the main the quote-unquote main character you start as yeah and the other thing i would i would just suggest is just get us like two characters a month not one two characters a month at least like speed it up you know yeah mm -hmm. It might be contrived that two students somehow unlock their powers at the same time, but whatever. We're talking about a game where people pull masks out of their face and summon Satan, so whatever. <laughs> I mean, I, I always saw it as a case of, like, a lot of, like, pretty much all of those Social Link characters had the potential to unlock Personas. It's just they never had, like, the, the opportunity to. Like, I, like yeah, like, like M Mishima definitely, if he had, like, stumbled into the metaverse at some point, he definitely would have unleashed a persona. Uh, every person, really. Yeah, like, all this, yeah, all the social link characters. If any of those kids from Yasagami High went into the persona, no, Inaba High, sorry, what am I saying? Oh, is it Yasagami? I don't know. Yasagami, yeah. Yasagami. If any Yasagami one of them jumped right. into the TV accidentally, they would have gotten a persona, assuming they didn't die. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, Morgana's dancing. Yep. Oh, it's so cute. <gasps> Missed opportunity to have Morgana on here. Yeah. This little grin gets me every time. <laughs> okay, but has anyone played Jack Bros? I played uh, Shin Megami Tensei Synchronicity Prologue, which is basically Jack Bros 2. <laughs> that game's dope. Play it. Now I need to go track down a virtual boy. <laughs> yeah, right. Atlas, give us Jack Bros 3, you cowards. <laughs> <laughs> You've asked for it for years, so now it's the Virtual Boy online service. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. You can play Kevin Costner's Waterworld. Not responsible for any damage done to your eyes. And Wario Land. You mean the yeah. only good game on the thing? What about Jack Bros? Please take breaks every 10 minutes. I don't know if Jack Bros is at, the original Jack Bros is actually good. I, I just know it's, I wish I could try it. Morgana's feelings for on bad feels, bro. <laughs> bad feels, bro. Fun fact: Jack Bros. Jack Bros. on Virtual Boy is the first Shin Megami Tensei game released in the West. That's ridiculous. Well, what about Snowboard Kids? That's not a Shin Megami Tensei game. <laughs> the, vir the, virtual boy, the virtual Boy. Yeah, besides, the Virtual Boy was before the N64. So yeah. almost counts. I'm just imagining that game being repackaged as Shin Megami Tensei Snowboard Kids. <laughs> That's what we need for the next P5 spinoff. Persona 5 Snowboard. So Persona 5 Snowboard Kids, yes. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, those are kind of fun games. I wouldn't mind if Atlas brought them, brought it, you know, made a Snowboard Kids 3. 
Yeah. Too long since I've played an SSX game. Do it, Atlas. It's not really an SSX game. It's it's closer to Mario Kart than SSX. Oh, interesting. Okay. Lady it, on. It's like it's like if Mario Kart was more focused on the actual racing aspect than the wacky item hijinks part. Okay. And everyone had a big nose. Yeah. <laughs> also, the devil kid was there. And the do and the shopkeep was a dog. <laughs> of course. I can't wait to listen to the VOD so I can actually hear what they're dancing to. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this remix I like a lot. The uh, Tokyo Daylight remix in P5D is one of my favorite songs in the game. Like how it vibes. Makoto left by like, did I leave the oven on? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking that too. He's like, what am I doing? <laughs> Um, I don't have my Morgana plush with me, but I brought something close enough. <laughs> Mom, can we get Morgana? We Morgana, have Morgana, at Morgana, at Morgana at home. Morgana at home. <laughs> uh, this is actually a wrestling thing, though. But he's cute. He looks hot the ball. So cute. Sit down, Daryl. Okay. Man, if if only they could patch. Uh, if only they could either patch or do. I, I would love to see a royal DLC where they can put in a Kasumi and then also the, all of the new songs. Like I, I would love because the 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 song that they use for the new palace in Royal, I absolutely love, and I would love to see a remix of it in here. Is there a lot of DLC for this game? A lot of costumes. Uh, a few. Songs for sure. Not bad. I think this is the I'm not first sure time entirely what everything is, but I, I know there's like Yakuza costumes for this game. Yeah, I saw that when I was like trying to download a catchy. Um, but yeah, there's there's a ton of customization. Well, I was also yeah. gonna say that like I think this is the first time I've selected Ren this entire time. Yes. I'm so yeah, surprised no one donated because, for Ren because he was in last place. <laughs> <laughs> I like with, one with one dollar. It's Goker. <laughs> Ash looks terrible on him. <laughs> I'll give it a shot. You can do it. Watching this stream almost makes me curious enough to play some Persona. Not enough to buy one straight away, but more curious than it was before. The hour and a half start on P4 with no gameplay and seeing how social links work did not really make me want to play more. Ah, interesting. I do kind of get that because like it, it, it was it, it took it took Caro pressuring me to play P5 and then watching me play P5 to, yeah. for me to finally get into it. I literally told Stefan for months, play Persona 5, play Persona 5, play Persona 5. <laughs> and then I saw my library had it in, so I'm like, okay, I'll try it out. Yeah, and then I, and then I, I had you. And then I had you watch over me while I was trying to beat Kamoshida's palace. That I couldn't figure yeah, out what to do. I remember that. But, I don't know. Help me! And but then after you did that, then I figured out what to do. So yeah, yeah. They, they, they have a they have like a weird uh, like starting starting gap just to kind of figure it out. Are they tiny again? Yep. Yep. <laughs> okay. So yeah, if you're interested in Persona 5, definitely get it. Get Royal. Or get the dancing game, I don't know. Whatever <laughs> suits you. <laughs> you probably wait for Scramble. But it's a sequel, right? Yeah, it is. I, I, I don't. I haven't like looked up what the story is, but I, at least from what I've heard, is that it isn't like super in like connected to. It's basically just like it, it, like the characters are all fully formed, but like in terms of plot, I don't think it fully connects to uh, the events of P five. It's probably. I think it's mostly stand standalone. Okay. <laughs> Honey, I shrunk the phantom. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. 
Scramble is also going to be on Switch, so... That also is a good thing if you don't have a PlayStation. I hope it runs decent on Switch. When I played the demo, it ran pretty well. Okay. I just know um, Koi messed up the um, Dragon Quest Heroes ports to Switch, but that was also very early in the Switch's lifespan. Yeah. Uh, and they made some bad decisions. Like, they ported... The version they based the port on was the um, PS3 version instead of the PS4 version. So it was bad decisions all around. But hopefully they figured things out for Scramble's port. I didn't even know Heroes was on Switch. Yeah, it was Japan only. Uh, Dragon Quest Heroes 1 Plus 2 was a Japan only Switch port. It's been such a struggle coming up with choreography for Morgana. Yeah. Probably easier than Teddy, though. Because Morgana has, like, actual limbs. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was going to say, Morgana can move, like, more freely. I like how they were just like, yeah, we're not bringing Koromaru to P3 dancing. Sorry, <laughs> not sorry. <laughs> <That was> amazing. <laughs> oh, my God. You can make the dog flip. Hey, Koromaru flip. <laughs> they had a chance. Yes, boy. Okay, so um, next was, I want to say it was on. Yes, it's on next. Oh, I'm sorry, on. <laughs> on. Hold on, wait, wait, technically, did, 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 you, did you do Yusuke? Because Yusuke is before uh, I mean, She's on. doing better than the main character. <laughs> yeah, I mixed up the order with like Yusuke and Ryuji, so my bad there. But um, next is on. And then after that, we're going to do Joker songs. So, yeah. I love rivers in the desert. Let's see. Don't I change anything with On? On is last. Why? Because people donated five bucks for her. And she's not last. Joker got one buck. Put on the Tanaka mask. <laughs> no! The Smash Brothers character got one dollar. How'd she shove her pigtails under there? That's impressive. Yeah, she has like thick hair, so I don't know how she does that, but. <laughs> Get ready! Set the standard for us! Cursed. God damn it, the mask again. Yeah. <laughs> With all the sexy moves, I hate that face. I can't. It's strangely arousing. <laughs> someone said it, it, someone said it, 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 it is Sunday today, so his shopping program is on now. Yes, that is true, Sunday morning. Yeah. Oh, Ryan ran away. <laughs> Maybe he didn't like this. I wonder if people like this show. Could be worse, could be that mask with either the bikini or Phantom Thief outfit. Oh, oh my God. no. Tanaka, I'll say this, Tanaka's definitely trying new ways to get more people to tune into his um, show. 
2020. I think this is what hell looks like. Just this. <laughs> Nothing but this. Just continuously. Imagine you went to get a late night snack in the kitchen one day, and this was in your kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> you walk, you come home after a long night, and you turn on the living room, and then you see um, Anna and a Tanaka mask. What do you do? <laughs> Not gonna see the new social event. Oh, there, there she is. Social events, social events. The viewers want to see the compelling story. The very compelling want... story of Persona Five dancing. <laughs> is, isn't this, the the story is like is like Justine and Caroline want 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 them to dance like in a competition against the cast from P3? Yeah, well, they're specifically actually... competing against uh, Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Yeah. yeah, and they're like, oh, and, and and if you and if you lose, you'll you'll be tortured, and it's like what? And they're like, yeah, but 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 this, but this is but this is all a dream, so it's like it it, it it it'll it'll still hurt, but it's like you won't like won't like really hurt you. So they're just like, oh, well, we kind of we kind of don't want to be tortured, so let let's dance. Yeah, I was gonna say the stories for um, P three. D and P five D kind of cross over with each other because there's just one social link scene that you see where it's it's implied that Futaba is talking with um Fuka, Fuka? yeah <gasps> because Fuka so talks cool. to someone who's Alibaba <gasps> and if you play P five Alibaba is um, the alias for Futaba so that was pretty cool when I um, saw that scene oh that's really neat. Mm -hmm. Yusuke, do you still want her to model for you? <laughs> Wearing the mask. I mean, he seems into it. <laughs> yeah, he does. Yes, hon. Come with your Tanaka mask. <laughs> Come on. Oh my God. Let me grace your beauty. Twirling her pigtail, but there's no pigtail. <laughs> <laughs> Either that, it's the worst Sonic the Hedgehog impression I've ever seen. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm annoyed they didn't dub Q2 Q2 as well. Because like that 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 was the that was the main reason I got this was because that I that I played the P5D was because that they dubbed it. Because I love this cast. Like I think that this cast is one of the best uh, English uh, dub casts uh, of like recent memory. Yeah. Everybody is perfect. I just love how the voice actors are also so attached to their character too. Mm. Yeah. Like, um, I love seeing like um, the Ons voice actress. Um, Harlicker. Harlicker, yeah. Um, she's been playing P5R on her Twitch. It's just oh, like cool. so awesome. Yeah, like, they've all been like playing like uh, what is it? Uh, uh, Max Middleman, uh, Matthew Mercer, and Robbie Damon. I think it's them three. Like they've been doing like a bunch of streams yeah. of playing E Five R, and those are all really funny to see. Oh, that's adorable! Instead of Matt Mercer, it's Ray Chase. Oh, pff, that's right. Uh, but which, Ray which Chase one? is in Persona Five because he touts that he was the subway announcer. That's right, the subway oh, announcer okay, guy. Yeah. I love that video that he did. <laughs> The most important character of Persona 5. Aoyama Ichome. This is Aoyama Ichome. That guy, right? Yeah. <laughs> Without him, they can't get to school. <laughs> Cassandra Lee Morris annoying everyone with Morgana sleep talk. Yes! <laughs> that 
that last pose with a mask on. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. Oh, I just ran into the Sorry, sorry chat, we don't have a mask, a Tanaka mask to raffle today. Just a Pikmin plushie. And, and now, and now I just remembered that. Because, choice, by the way. And, and now I just remember that because since uh, P5A is being dubbed, then that means we get to actually hear Xander Mobis actually talk as Joker <laughs> for a, a, an actual amount of time rather than just one word. I lend it! <laughs> yeah. Hara <laughs> Mitama! Jack Frost! Now we're getting to the Joker songs. Yeah! Yay. Also, I'm, uh... Yeah, because, I mean, yeah, Anaplex being stupid, selling it for $300. I, I am pretty sure that they're gonna put, they're gonna put the dub, like, on one of the uh, streaming services. Yeah. They don't have like I'm. I'm pretty sure unless if they lock it under that that the, you have to buy the the Blu-ray in order to watch the dub and you like they don't put it on the streaming. So that's just gonna be really stupid on their part. Mm -hmm. Like there's there's no reason not to just yeah just to put it on uh, to put it on like whatever I don't know what Anaplex uses. Uh, H Dive I think I don't know if it's H Dive or uh, one of those. Yeah. I know the I know the, the Japanese uh, yeah the Japanese version of P five P five A is on uh, Crunchyroll. Okay. Uh, yeah, it might also it, be on that. Because the released on Crunchyroll, like when they were yeah. staring, it was simulcast yes. or something like that. No 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 no, I don't think it was. Was it? God, I don't remember. It was like a couple years ago. Is everyone just, I just noticed, is everyone looking away from Joker? Are they not even <laughs> yeah, looking no. at him dance? <laughs> no, there's some people. There's, oh. But yeah, a lot of people are just resolutely facing the other way. <laughs> <laughs> While this guy in a clown nose just dances. Because Joker's such a clown. You were not a clown. You were a fire circus. <laughs> See, uh, saying saying Aniplex is better than Funimation doesn't really make any sense because they're both owned by the same company. Like they're basically like Funimation and Aniplex are both Sony. So it's like the only the only difference is that one sell one sells over hundreds of dollars for their physical releases, and one actually has like a fairly decent price. So that's the only difference. It's Japan. Dancing on the street is normal. Is that true, Caro? Um, I feel like that's very not true. No, <laughs> I think like people would just stare at you. If you did that. Unless you have like some license, because I think it works the same way as it does in the states. I don't recall anyone dancing incredible. on the street when They're I was shutting in Tokyo. Let alone yeah, Korea. <laughs> that crosswalk is so busy. <laughs> Oh, is this the big Shibuya crossing? Yeah. yeah. So there's no way you'd have this much room to dance. No, no, this <laughs> this part of like Shibuya is so crowded. Doesn't matter what time of day it's, it is. I've been there in the morning, I've been there late at night. There's like always thousands of people just walking on the scramble. That's cool. I remember like, when I was playing Persona 5 for the first time, like I went to Japan a couple months after I beat it. And I remember going through Shibuya and I was like, oh my God, that's where the Man of Thieves met and that's where the crosswalk and everything. Oh, that's so cool. Mm -hmm. did, 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 did you go to see the real life LeBlanc? I forget. Um, No, I did, actually didn't have time to make a trip to, it's called Songenjaya, the neighborhood in real life. It's not Yogenjaya. Oh, oh that's weird. <laughs> Or is it the other way around? No, no, no Yongen Jaya is the one in the game. Huh. Okay, Songen Jaya is what it's based off of. So, <laughs> let's go. I know someone did like this, um, like article a few years ago where like um, they went to Songen Jaya, 
and like for the most part a lot of the things are there the laundry the laundry like area that's actually like legit too so i'm like wow oh that's so cool mm -hmm. Uh, the, the, this 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 is where you this is where you fight uh, the Shido's boss. Yeah, this is where Shido is. That's why Rivers in the Desert is playing. Hey. <laughs> he asks Shido, "Do you recognize me?" Who are you? Starts dancing. Well, now? <laughs> I don't even know who you are. <laughs> you have taken everything from me. <laughs> I'd recognize that dance anywhere. <laughs> That's what he got arrested for? He just danced on Cheetah? It's <laughs> <laughs> just imagining that, like... When he saved the girl from Shido, he just started breaking out and dance. No, no, he he uh, he uh, he uh, Fortnite dances. <laughs> Stop dancing, kid! Leave me alone. Persona 5 told through interpretive dance would just be a lot of finger point, finger gun pointing at each other. <laughs> <laughs> More or less so than Persona 3 told through interpretive dance. <laughs> well, they're pointing the fingers at themselves. Okay, not, not, it's it's not as, as much as that. Own head. <laughs> yeah. But this one's at each other. That one's at yeah. their own heads. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he dabbed on Shido. <laughs> Damn brat, I'll sue. Dab. <laughs> we got any donations? Not at the moment. All righty. Thank you all for your donations. This has been amazing. Viewer. I know, like, I saw that we hit uh, 20k last night, and that's, like, super, like, legit. Especially with what's going on in the world right now. I just didn't expect us to, like, raise this much. So, like, yeah. just know that we super appreciate all of you just coming out on the radio and just spreading the word in general. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I heard Metal Gear was really fun. Like y'all did a great oh, job. Oh my gosh, it was it was a lot of fun. Yeah, um, I didn't tune into that because um, I still want to play Metal Gear, so I didn't want to get spoiled. But mm -hmm. sure, it was I a mean, good time. You know, I mean, I I haven't beaten the original Metal Gear Solid. I watched like most of it, and I'm still completely lost. <laughs> it's okay. I don't think even Kojima knows what's going on. <laughs> War is bad? Question mark. Yes. War is bad. Okay, so um, we're done with all the character songs. There are some special like movie songs I'm gonna play through now. So thank you all for playing for you know donating towards the bid war. It was great. So last minute save with um, Futaba, but now we're gonna go through um, the special songs. So no characters for this one. Um, they're just like little cutscenes that play, but they're still really cute to watch. So yeah. And the thing is, when you're when you're playing, you can't really pay attention to the funs that's going on in the background, like the video going on in the background. Yeah. So I'm gonna actually see what's going on for the first time because I'm usually oh, playing okay. the game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's so cute. yeah, Joker with a guitar. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's a music, it's a music video. <laughs> I can't reach the keyboard. <laughs> that whole keyboard, there's no way. You can play.
play about two or three octaves. <laughs> you scared just chilling. <laughs> <laughs> this is the universe where the boys become real thieves. <laughs> Oh, it's the cops! <laughs> Fuck 12. Fuck 12. <laughs> oh, I realize half the call is Canadians who probably don't know what that yeah, means. Yeah, half the call is Canadians. Because <laughs> I think that's an American thing. Yeah. Yep, don't know. 12 no. refers to the drug unit at no. most police departments, so yeah. it's a big rallying cry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it looks like Regrana is just like banging his out on the key on the keyboard. <laughs> like if his arms won't reach, like yeah, there we go. <laughs> just <laughs> Someone asked, "Was was 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 that 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 just the what is love meme?" Oh my god! <laughs> when they were in the car. What is love? <laughs> 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 da, 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 So, like, this is the song for the Persona boys. There's also a song for the Persona girls. Dang, that's a lot of cop cars. <laughs> I'm a Persona boy, and I'm Persona girl. <laughs> this is just like the ending of the Blues Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> That's the benefit of your car being a living entity. Going downstairs is far easier. Yeah. <laughs> is it ever explained why Morgana can turn into a van? Yes. Because it's it's about like the uh, the 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 people's the the general public's cognition in like the it's basically just a a. Uh, Fuck uh, the 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 uh, the, uh, cat, the the Miyazaki cat bus reference because the general public has a cognition that they they have a cognition of seeing cats as buses. So oh, that's super cool. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I guess yes, yeah, so it, it it is Totoro. I, I was forgot for for some reason I forgot which exactly Miyazaki movie the cat bus was in. It was Totoro. So yeah, it is like a literal reference. It's like oh, people people know about my neighbor Totoro, so that's how she uh, he's able to turn into. A vehicle. That's so cool. <laughs> now I'm gonna play the girl song. Yay. Yay. Which is totally not filled with a lot of fan service. <laughs> I know. Persona and fan service? What? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> Two seconds in. Yeah. <laughs> uh, is this like a Moulin Rouge reference? Feels yeah. like it. Totally reminds me of Mulan <laughs> Lady Marmalade. <laughs> we can be lovers. <laughs> Band. Okay, those outfits are super cute, though. They are. It feels it feels like a uh, they had it coming vibe. Yeah, it does have that that uh, Chicago look to it. Oh yeah. yeah. We're go. We are in horny jail now. Yeah, we're yeah. literally <laughs> horny jail. We talked about it all marathon. Here it is. 
horny. No, th th this is more like the horny asylum. It was all leading yeah, to this. Yeah, I told you. FBI is on the way. <laughs> Nine days of buildup. What are they wearing? Outfits that would be hella cute if they were legal. Oh. <laughs> is legal 17 or 18? 18. 18. Okay, so yeah, none of them are legal. Steven in the chat. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> I really like Takeover, but I think I like Last Surprise just a bit more. But Takeover is really good. Yeah, I like Last Surprise like the best. It's it's a classic at this point. Last Last Surprise is so Last Surprise is so good that yeah, you can have it heard like like every at the start of pretty much every single battle throughout the entire game, and it still doesn't get old. No. Like that is always. For the first time, I'm like, yo, this is good. Oh no! Now they're in horny jail. They're in horny jail. Crap. Wait, who's going to horny jail? No, they are. They were in jail cages. Um, Elliot thinks life will change is better. Life will change is really great. Like, let me see if I had to rank. If I had to rank all of the. Let me try and rank all the the songs. My favorite Persona 5 song isn't in this game. It's um, Sunset Bridge, if you know that one. Mm -hmm. I'm impressed that Haru's thigh highs are staying up through all this dancing without, like, garters. Brilliant. I'd probably have to say the the, uh, the two the two ending the two end credits songs for P5 and P5R are probably my least favorite. Like they're not bad. I just they're uh, I just like the more fast paced uh, versions of the other songs. <laughs> this is the song you play in your parents walking. <laughs> <laughs> are you winning, so Elliot? <laughs> Elliot came to me and he's like, "Are you winning, son?" <laughs> sure. <laughs> I guess. The song I'm playing right now is actually the opening theme for this game, which I oh, like cool. a lot. This is a good song. And now Joker walks into traffic. <laughs> walks into the Shibuya scramble. I think I think dancing on the subway, you can't do that in Japan. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure people will glare at you very hard. Joker, no, watch out! <laughs> Break it up to you. Oh, Joker's watching the stream too. <laughs> <laughs> He's watching me. Oh my god. <laughs> the Joker. The Joker. Super Smash Brothers Joker. <laughs> Joker persona. Kawakami should be in this game. 
let her dance. Okay. We have a five dollar donation from Tsubaki Paradox. Thank you so much. Uh, the life will change video, specifically the boys driving and head bopping, is a reference to this old video. And and yes, it's also the what is love meme. Atlas are awesome, lol. Anyways, great stream, guys. I'm off to buy booze for Mario Party. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so excited for Mario Party later. It's going to be great. I'm so excited. You ready for Mario Party, Elliot? <laughs> it's going to be uh, you, Caro, Elliot, Sabrina, and John, right? Yeah. Oh, that's going to be hilarious. Do you, do you guys do you guys have, have the mic for Mario Party 6? Wait, what about the mic? You can because that, that that game that game has like a mic that you can use for some mini games. Do you have the mic? Do we have them? You don't need it. Okay. Yeah, you you, you don't need it, but it's like it's optional. Yeah, yeah we'll be fine. Well, Is I don't know what a performance. I don't know what a performance in the tournament's going to be like after Mario Party. <laughs> yeah, y'all going to be drinking. <laughs> yeah, Captain, this is a Persona Five AMV. <laughs> they ripped it off of YouTube. They just put dancing the dancing prompts over it. <laughs> I wonder how much minutes of anime footage there are in uh, in the game. <laughs> um, Elliot said, um, "What was it like?" <laughs> oh, Yuji's face there. Oh my Man, god. Like, like, oh my god. Nearly every nearly every single anime uh like cutscene in this game has a moment where uh the, the characters like uh linger on on <laughs> The male gaze is real. Don't tell me it isn't. I love the mo moment when, when she throws Morgana and he turns into the threat right as they fall into her. Oh, wait, um, what was that post? Someone's ass was in the air. I'm going to have to go back and watch it. Yeah. <laughs> there was definitely a guy's ass in the air. <laughs> it reminds me of the part in the P5 anime where um, Yosuke's face is on Kanji's ass. Right. <laughs> Uh, are they gonna show my favorite? Oh, they didn't show my favorite part. Oh, the fan of thieves lined up. No, no, the fan of thieves. When when when, uh, when Ryuji has his face and he's like, "We got him." Oh yeah. And then Ryuji explodes. So Ryuji explodes in the credits roll. <laughs> And you can see all these wonderful moments if you pick up Persona 5 for your PlayStation yes, 4. Yes, this, this um, stream is one giant commercial for Persona 5 Royal. Atlas, is, told, Atlas is totally paying me to do this. I'm on the Atlas payroll. That means, <laughs> that means I'm on two payrolls. I'm on Atlas's payroll. And Kasumi I'm on is nowhere payroll, here, so. so it's not it's not for Royal because Kasumi's nowhere to be seen here. Where was she? <laughs> He's dead. What? Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> okay, so Sabrina thought that Joker was what? A custom character? <laughs> oh my god. See, that's what Persona 6 should do. Persona 6 should have customizable <laughs> characters. But then they can't do like anime cutscenes. Yeah. Fair. Kind of. Yeah, some, someone said- girl. Someone said watching you play this finally got, got me to cave in and order five, P5R. Yes! yes! Okay. Um, so I'm going to do... Um, there is one song here where it's everyone together. So. Oh, cute. Everyone is here. Everyone's here, so I can customize them. <laughs> no! Don't give them... Don't give any of them the mask. I let what? their face actually show up. Give them the up. mask? 
Yes, let's give them all the mask. No. This camp. Okay. Oh no. You are terrible. I know. <laughs> that reveal on like the the billboard in Shibuya, but instead of wearing a phantom theme mask, they're all wearing the Tanaka mask. <laughs> well, Morgana can't wear the mask. On's fine. Yusuke, mask time. <laughs> Tanaka 5 dancing. <laughs> what? Oh my god! Elliot said, isn't this a full Persona 5 fan cam, this game? <laughs> oh my god. This is terrible. Making fan cams is fun. I like making Okay. And last but not least, Futaba. Is this mask in P3? The P3 dancing? I think it yes. is. Oh my god. It's in every single dancing game. Really? Oh, that's hilarious. It was in the P4 as well, yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're ready for this? <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> and just, Bitch, just I hate it! it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> God, that's my face! <laughs> oh my God! It looks like a cult. And anonymous is weird. <laughs> well, the Dark Order is doing some interesting things for recruitment as of late. <laughs> V for Vendetta was like, it's been a while since I watched that movie. <laughs> remember, remember, the 5th of November. Ah. <laughs> Tanaka, your heart. <laughs> Dialogue is like, let's dance like the branches in the wind. As oh, he's wearing the Tanaka mask. <laughs> yes, yes, case are, these case are ridiculous. It just looks like an N64 render of Miyamoto. Oh my gosh, that is <laughs> not wrong. Oh no! You're right, when's Goldeneye dancing? <laughs> Daniel Craig. This is a very interesting take on Vince McMahon. <laughs> And also, they're dancing like in the final boss area. Nice. Oh, at least in the original game. I'll say. What's next? WWE dancing all night? <laughs> Yo! Yo! I would love that! Oh my god! <laughs> DDR WWE mix is what Elliot says we need. We need to. Where the stage is missing Yaldabaoth, we need to dab on him. <laughs> how, do you, how do you beat the embodiment of the seven deadly sins that consume all of humanity? Dab on them haters. Everyone's hearts. I can feel them. Dab on Jesus. 
Or dab with Jesus. Dab with <laughs> Jesus? Makoto's on the other half of the stage, right? Yeah. It's competing. <laughs> He's got, he's, oh got his hair on. he's got his harem with him. <laughs> what do you say we end our turn? Hutava's <laughs> <laughs> just singing to call her anxiety. Oh, it's so cute. Relatable. Yeah. <laughs> <We're coming. laughs> what the fuck? I seen some shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> Why, why, wait, I forget, can, can you dance, can you dance with Justine and Caroline? Yes, yeah. you can. Um, you can do, do that, that in catchy DLC as well. Yeah, Dan, you gotta, you gotta dance with the twins. Uh, I can do that after this, yeah. You gotta do inmate. <laughs> yeah, how did Ryuji cheer Morgana up wearing that mask? <laughs> I would've run. <laughs> I, like, yeah, I, can... I like when the combo thing just covers up Morgana completely. Everyone, let's do it. Somebody asked, are you also able to dance with uh, La, La, La Lavenza? Or is it just Justine and Caroline? It's Justine and I think, Caroline. I think that's a DLC song. No, um, when I clicked on the Akechi um, character select, like it let me choose Justine and Caroline. I mean, Lavenza. Yeah, Lavenza, someone says Lavenza's oh, yeah. DLC. Lavenza is DLC. Right. For this kind of stuff. Next. So I'm going to do a catchy again. <laughs> but nice. Justine and Caroline. Be you can give him double eye patches. It's amazing. What? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm blind. <laughs> this is so crazy. You can make him wear sunglasses. <laughs> No, you can't over dance the, with Over the eye down. patch. Oh yeah. my gosh. Over the eye patch. Oh my goodness. Oh, he's so cute. Let's do Caroline. I feel like the reason they didn't add Kasumi as DLC is because P5 dancing is, was, was a fairly like older game by the time Royal came out, so they just felt like it wasn't worth it. Yeah, that makes sense. I was shocked they didn't do um, the female protagonist from Persona 3, though. Yeah, mm -hmm. I was wondering where she was in a P3 dancing. Because they have this, like, songs from the PSP game, but they don't actually have her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I'm not, I'm not going to say more just to avoid... I'm not, I'm not going to say more to avoid spoilers, but uh, technically, other people who aren't wild cards do see the twins in Royal, so just, just making them a wild card isn't exactly why they just can see them. Persona 5 Dancing Royal. How's that? <laughs> no, they just come out, like, Vintage Atlas would be coming out with another Persona 5 Dancing game, but with Kasumi in it. Yeah, it's literally the exact same game, just with Kasumi in yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> Persona 5 1 and 2 Dancing, when? <laughs> Never. Never. They need to acknowledge Persona 5 1 and 2 first. <laughs> we ne we're never gonna get an SMT dancing because let's be real, like none of the SM mainline SMT protagonists would dance. Um, I was gonna say, like, would an SMT and dancing like not mix? No, it wouldn't. Like, Demi Fiend would just leave. Yeah. Uh, I don't think anyone from SMT4 would either dance or be good at it. I mean, the the guy you're playing as right now would never dance either. Yes, he would. Oh, yes, he would. No. If you play, if 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 you can play darts with Ren, then I'm sure he can dance. He is a TV personality, Stefan. Yes. 
He's a if fake he TV. A, if he was he's on a, a fake talk TV show, personality. If he was on a talk show and they asked him to dance, he would dance. He would do it, and then behind the scenes, you'd just be like, fuck, I'm going to go and kill them. <laughs> I, I mean, isn't that what he's doing oh right God. now? <laughs> <laughs> Also, I feel like a lot of SMT music is not as suited to dancing, which is probably the more realistic. Are they hitting him while dancing? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess he would have interacted with them, right? I know. Like, I don't think. Well, I don't think so because I, from from what they say in the story is that Yaldabaoth just gave him the the meta. He gave him the metaverse like app, but he never actually interacted with them. That's weird. Yeah, yeah, because because they have no idea. Like they have no idea that uh, Akechi was also a wild card. Like Yaldabaoth obviously knows, and he's just fucking with everybody. But yeah, they are they're completely unaware. I would figure if they, if he gives Joker a velvet room, he should give Akechi a velvet room. Yeah. Well, yeah, it, it, yeah. It, it, it's 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 because he rigged the game. Like he just wanted he he gave it to Akechi because he know he was uh, like unstable and that he would like do some bad shit. And then made the velvet room for uh, Akira because he wanted like he wanted Akira to like go the, the opposite way of him so that like they would see which one would win out in the end. I suppose. Okay, so um, I'm gonna play one more song. I'm just gonna show what all night mode looks like just so you see how ridiculous this game is, <laughs> and then um, Elliot's gonna set up for Luigi's Mansion. Luigi. I'm not gonna even get through like the first minute of this. <laughs> so. Yeah, he said. Uh, yes, yeah, some, someone said uh, he's a, he's he's just utterly shit at getting other personas. He can't social link. He can't negotiate with demons. He's only got two persona. What's a good persona game to start off with? Five. Five's good. Start with five. Yeah. got the most quality of life changes compared to three and four like quality of life improvements compared to three and four it is tons of fun um great soundtrack if you want to jump in with five it's not connected to the other four games other than the universe but not in terms of story it's just like final fantasy yeah kind of like, like there, it's it's the same shared universe, and there are like references if you can actually spot them. But oh. yeah, like, how, like that, how, looks, how, that looks real tough. Yeah, my my, my eyes are going cross-eyed. Even normal difficulty in this game is really hard. Like, but yeah, that's what all night mode looks like, and yeah, that was P5 dancing. Cats can't dance. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, um, I think we're just gonna end a little bit early so we give Elliot time to set up for Luigi's Mansion. So, thank y'all for joining me for um, Persona 5 Dancing. Thank you to Catherine, Stefan, Clement, Ryan. I know Ryan's not in the, in the voice call anymore, but if he's listening, thank you. All right. Toodles. All right. Bye. Wow.